Hello all, uh, greetings from uh, test automation practice of Novachetech Private Limited. Novachetech Private Limited is an independent software testing and quality assurance service company. So this demo is to kind of demonstrate our homegrown test automation framework called Raft. Raft is a reusable automation framework for testing. It is ready to use framework built on Selenium and other open source libraries that enables cost effective solution. We can automate testing of web, mobile or API using Raft. So it can be extended uh, uh, to BDD approach using Cucumber. So the key salient, salient features of Raft is execution reports. The framework provides different forms of reports, captures time of execution, browser, OS, environment details, screenshots, branding information, and all test execution metrics such as how many pass, fail, and overall statistics. It provides email integration. Once the, uh, you know, the execution is completed, the report gets emailed to the uh, key stakeholders. It enables debugging. It captures each and every steps in the logs. So at any point of time, if you want to investigate a defect, you can go to the logs and find out. And we follow the standard coding standards that enables to improve the performance of the automation suit and enables easy maintenance. In highly structured, we have different folders segregated for object repository, common functions, utility functions, driver scripts, control scripts, you know, segregation of test data, screenshots, logs, execution report, and configurable environment. Object repositories is easy to maintain and easy to enhance because it's a set of properties and it is bound using Maven uh, to ensure integration and easy maintenance. It enables to uh, get configured to enable continuous integration using Jenkins and it also supports mobile test automation using APM and it supports you know, API test automation using REST Assured. So we also uh, in a enable the version control using the Maven build. So the key feature, key benefits, you know, huge cost savings, you know, quick, you know, building of automation suit and easy continuous integration. It supports, you know, mobile automation, API test automation and uh, uh, web automation. So I, we, have, we would like to co quickly go through the framework as I said earlier. So this is the framework. It has different, you know, uh, test data files are there, test output is there, you know, we have logs. So we have logs, uh, you know, uh, test output where you have the reports, different forms of reports are there. And then, uh, and then we have, uh, you know, screenshots and we have logs. So all the, you know, logs gets captured at any point of time, you can retrieve those logs. So here we have automated, uh, you know, um, simple scenario using Sigurd CRM where we will create lead and, you know, schedule a appointment with the lead so let me start this we have launched eclipse and let me start this now so it is going to launch a browser so these are the features of craft like automatically it's uh, you know launches the chrome browser and it enters the credentials you know from the excel that it, it gives the data, data driven approach and the login credentials and logs in and checks for the lead you know whether the lead particular lead is already available in the system. If it is available, it will create. If it is not available, then it creates the you know lead. It picks the value from the Excel and you know fits in the application. So it enters the first name, last name, you know, website, you know, street, state, India, and email address. And it creates the lead and then it checks for the duplicate and then it schedules the you know meeting. For the particular lead, so that th those are the two couple of scenarios you know we have automated to demonstrate uh, the uh, raft features. So once it's done, automatically the uh, the final report you know launches, where you can see you know what are the different you know as soon as towards end of the automation, it automatically uh, launches the application. So sends the email to the you know key stakeholders. So now the report is getting launched. So the execution is completed now. So now this features has, you know, it has run one test case and it is passed. And these are the uh, different, you know, forms of, uh, you know, data. It also gives, you know, what is the duration, when it is started, 
when it is ended and how much time it has taken it also gives the other information like what is the environment OES browser and Java version and it also captures the runner logs it also sends there are also other type of reports available where uh, you know we can go to the test output where you can see what is the you know report you know, available So this is the report you know uh, that is run now so it says what are the you know different features and you know it is being passed how many minutes it has taken and what are the different steps it has gone through and th uh, uh, these are the different forms of reports and it also sends the email to the key stakeholders the same report extended reports can also be sent to the uh, key stakeholders so let's open that so this is the same report you know, which we saw where it has all the information that in forms of you know uh, pages where it, it displays uh, where it is being executed what is the browser and what is the OS version being executed and it also captures the uh, test logs so that's all about the RAP features this is on the web application we have other uh, things you know on mobile and uh, API in subsequent videos thank you have a nice day